Hey, what's up? It's Jay Bigga. So everybody's talking about this whole John Hawk rape live on stick cam thing. Okay, apparently, this is totally unverified, but um, I got a message while we were live on Ustream that <clears throat> stick cam celeb, or whatever, I've never actually seen this guy, John Hawk raped a girl who, on live on stick cam with 100 people watching, okay, and um, this is the story. John Hawk's roommate had this girl over, and according to the person who told me this, John Hawk fed her, quote unquote, a bunch of Xanax. Okay, now I don't know how, what that means to feed someone Xanax, but she was apparently passed out, and so he was laughing about the fact that there's this passed out chick at his house. And what turns on stick cam, he's on stick cam, and then starts having sex with this girl on stick cam. Okay, so now I guess he's in jail. Well, that to me does not mean anything, because I know that most people who are in jail did not do anything wrong. But um, the story is, from what a lot of people have said, is that there are screenshots of John Hawk raping this unconscious chick on stick cam. Now, okay, my question was, um, if she had been sober and awake, like, would she have been like, cool, let's have sex, or like, was that his girlfriend? And so, according to sources, um, and um, like, like I said, this is just my commentary on it, and nothing is verified, but he, she did not like John Hawk, and um, she would have said, hell no, and she only found out about the fact that they had sex on camera because other people, like, sent her pictures. Um, so, apparently, now this, this guy was, like, in trouble for it and went to jail for it or something. So, <clears throat> I have no idea what's going on. Now, okay, everybody is really upset at John Hawk about this, and I, it sounds like he did something kind of bad. But then again, you know, she's the one who also got so fucked up on Xanax that she couldn't push him off. Now, I know that probably John Hawk is going to get in a lot of trouble for this whole situation, if it is in fact true, which I have no way of knowing, because um, I didn't see it. But, um, <clears throat> you know, honestly, like, I've gotten some fucked up shit that's happened to me when I've been unconscious on drugs. So, you know... I re and I don't blame anyone but myself. I'm not out there being like, dude, I got so messed up on drugs that you gave me. You're the bad one for it, you know? You don't, bl okay, like let's say somebody is at a bar and they drink a lot of liquor and then they get in a car crash. Do you go back to the bartender and you're like, you gave this person too much alcohol? You know, so it's just my opinion that um, it's both of their faults. I mean, first off, this dumb bitch, what do you expect? You pass out on Xanax at this freako's house, and according to the person who's telling me about this, John Hawk is kind of a weirdo, and he's high on drugs himself, and is the kind of person who would do this sort of thing. Um, and, you know, John Hawk, what are you doing having sex with an unconscious chick on Stickham? What are you doing having sex on Stickham to begin with? You know? I mean, seriously, keep it to yourself. So, I think it is both their faults. I think whatever happens to John Hawk should also happen to her. Because they're both just stupid people. And if it were my choice, I would sentence them to three months in the same house together with nothing but, like, a case of Jack Daniels and some vibrating dildos. And just, like, they could broadcast <laughs> the whole thing on Red Tube. And then everybody would just be happy. But it sounds like a ho horrible, messed up situation. And I honestly don't think anyone is to blame, but everyone involved. And um, I think it's funny as fuck. But seriously, dude, that's what you get for taking drugs. Both of them. I guess they're both on drugs. And this is kind of like just what I've heard. Because this is actually the first time I've ever actually heard of, any, of John Hawk. But, you know, what do you guys think? Post your comments below. Let me know what your opinion is about the whole thing. Um, I haven't seen the screenshots of John Hawk apparently raping. You know, I mean, I think the term rape is kind of like, you know, what would you call that? Like, she gets really fucked up on drugs. He's really fucked up on drugs. You know? They were both kind of high. I don't know. I, you know, I just think the whole circumstance is unfortunate. I'm sure they're both like... 
or horrible. So what do you guys think should happen to them? What do you guys think? Who's to blame? You know, <clears throat> probably Pfizer for inventing Xanax. I think they should both sue Pfizer Incorporated. <laughs> Just my opinion. <laughs> Pfizer should go to jail, not John Hawk or this dumb chick who is like unconscious. Anyways, um, yes, please post your opinions. I'm really, really curious, and I'm going to post this up on my YouTube, too. And um, you can also come on my MySpace. Can you guys see this little thing up on the top? I don't know. I want to know your opinions about the whole John Hawk thing. Okay? Later.